Taoiseach, for those who died in the Stardust disaster and their families, yesterday's apologies were welcome, but it was 43 years too late. Taoiseach, I ask you and your government to think of those 50 people who died so horrifically in Whitty Island on the 18th of January 1979, 45 years, 3 months and 14 days ago. These victims went to work at the offshore jetty off Whitty Island, Bantry Bay, where they were left without rescue to die for an inordinate period before the ship exploded. In 2021, RT's documentary, Fire in the Sky, which told the story of what happened in Whitty that night. And even then, after RT's TV news coverage, your predecessors, Leo Varadkar, Mian Martin, Wynne Taoiseach and other ministers have failed to meet the families following repeated requests and have shielded away from making comments, even when former President Mary McAleese called for a state apology. Taoiseach, uh, it is now urgent that the Whitty Island inquests are reconvened to establish the real truth about how 50 people died. The families of those who died in Whitty's disaster are like the Stardust families and are equally as steadfast in their pursuit of justice and are not going away. Taoiseach, will you meet with the Whitty Island disaster families to at least acknowledge their suffering today? Thank you, Taoiseach. Well, well, thanks, Jimmy Collins. I, I certainly acknowledge that they're, they're suffering, and I think of them, and I think of the 50 people who, who died, uh, and the 20, uh, 23 bodies ne never recovered. Um, I, I received correspondence, I think, yesterday in relation to this matter. I have it here in my hand, and I just want to give that due consideration. My understanding, and it's an initial understanding, because I need to be properly briefed on this, my understanding is the Attorney General was asked to, to, to look into some matters pertaining to this. I certainly intend to talk to the Attorney General about the matter, and I'm happy to revert to the House. Thank you, Deputy Ray